Well, the rules are changing to help breast cancer survivors. Barbara Nell is the founder of Back in the Swing, and she is here today on this, the third anniversary of my diagnosis. I remember that day that I got the phone, and what are you, what is this? The queen, you are the queen. You, I, have, you, know, you have run the race, and you are on your way to survivorship for sure. So, I remember that, you know, getting that call, it is a sad day, you know, but it's honestly, it's the beginning of becoming a survivor, you know, yeah. fighting that that fight right, to, right. to overcome it. Exactly, as well as getting healthy all from the, that day forward. And when I say queen, I mean you have embraced that healthy lifestyle. We have some courses in the fall that yes. are celebrating, well, I love the to say they're celebrating thing. you, but well, I have to say they're yeah. celebrating the fact that <laughs> starting January 1st, uh -huh. uh, the American College of Surgeons has designated to get accredited by the College of Surgeons. There has to be survivorship care in hospital settings to be accredited by that College of Surgeons. So yes. that's why everyone needs to take this course this mm -hmm. fall at Johnson County Community College, sponsored by University of Kansas Cancer Center, to really understand what this means and mm -hmm. how that healthy lifestyle you've embraced with movement and um, nutrition and uh, joyful attitude as well as all kinds of relaxation. I know you're totally relaxed, right? It's all so <laughs> important as we you know, try to remain healthy. And, exactly. And, and, you know, begin again, back in the swing. Exactly. I, I have to say that a lot of people may not know this, but back in the swing and you, mm -hmm. very instrumental in actually making this a mandate right. that hospitals across the country, this right. isn't just here locally. Exactly. You actually started a national movement that's being embraced, right. and right. now the hospitals will be Thank required you. when someone is finished with their treatment. I right. remember my last day of radiation, right. that's it, you're right. done. Right. Uh, you have to go back and all, but still to know what to do and, to, right. and how to live. And there's so many ways that we have to be involved. And it's so exciting because you'll finally get a plan. I mean, it's something we've been working for for 15 years. And this community, I so am so grateful to Kansas City, to everyone in this community, for supporting Back in the Swing and supporting the Breast Cancer Survivorship Center at the University of Kansas Cancer Center, which was one of the first survivorship centers in the country mm -hmm. uh, in 2007. Wow. And so your role model, your being the queen, <laughs> your going out there and spreading the word has helped so many people understand how to get a plan, live their plan, and stay healthy. And that's really the name of the game. So let's talk about these classes because mm -hmm. this is for anyone can come right. and take them, but it's right. also for medical professionals right. as well. Right, this is the first time it's ever been offered at the Johnson County Community College. Uh, you can go to backintheswing.org or go to this number that's right there in your hand. Uh, that would be 913-469-2323. Uh, and we're going to put that on our website. Fabulous. Um, and it's half day, uh, one day in September 27th um, for breast cancer survivors and their families. And the next day, October 18th, that's a Saturday, for healthcare providers. So what's so exciting is on both sides, we need to come together and say, this is how to pass along this care. This is how to, to actually help survivors live their plan, as well as the survivors saying, you know, going to their doctor and saying, you know, do I have a plan? Can mm -hmm. I get a plan? Yes. So both sides working together to stay healthy. And, and that, as you know, mm -hmm. uh, being the role model, as I said, uh, and this very important day for you um, is, is is what we all need to keep in mind is our good health. We need to remember that. Right. I will accept my crown. <laughs> Thank you so much. It's You're been welcome. a pleasure and a joy, and I'll continue reminding people to right. do their self-exams and get their mammograms. Exactly. Barbara, you know, we'll have you back on the show as we get closer to that right. January 1st mandate so for breast Thank cancer you. survivorship plans for everyone involved. Thanks right. for being Thank here. Thank you, Kansas City.